This video might surprise you and it might make you laugh at the same time. Many, many moons ago, there was a case where the police were called out to a bus stop and the person making the call said that there were kids on the bus. The police responded back to say, well, what do you mean the kids are on the bus? What are they doing on the bus? And they said, they are on the bus. And again, the clarification was sought, well, what are they doing on the bus? And the response came back once more saying, they are physically, quite literally, on the bus. And obviously what I mean is, this is an offence. In fact, it's even in the highway code. Rule 16 regarding moving vehicles state that you must not get onto or hold onto a moving vehicle. And this is in the Road Traffic Act of 1988, section 26. So you guessed it, pedestrians can also be prosecuted for offences in the highway code. And here are but a few of them. Another one, of course, is to do with motorways. Rule 6 of the highway code. Pedestrians must not be on motorways or slip roads except in an emergency situation. And those are covered by Rule 271 and 275. And this particular rule of the Highway Code is backed up by the Road Traffic Regulations Act, Section 17. Rule 271, by the way, states that you must not stop on any carriageway, emergency area, hard shoulder, slip road, central reservation, or verge except in an emergency, told to by the police or traffic officers, etc. If ever you've had a pedestrian crossing the road at a crossing and then stop to deliberately hold you up and cause the traffic problems, this is also an offence in Rule 18 of the Highway Code. Rule 18 of the Highway Code states that you must not loiter on any type of crossing. And remember, any time must not is used in the Highway Code, there is no ambiguity. It is something you must not do and is backed up as an offence. Equally with railway level crossings, Rule 34 of the Highway Code states you must not cross or pass a stop line when the red lights show. Now this, as I very often say, is, as I suggest, as clear as it gets. But once more, this amounts to an offence if someone were to do so because it is a must not and is backed up in legislation. Even if one were using a powered wheelchair or a scooter, they must not travel faster than four miles per hour on pavements or in pedestrian areas. So there it is, clearing up the ambiguity. Next time, if you have someone loitering on a crossing in front of you, they are committing an offence. So please remember to subscribe and thank you for watching.